Hello guys, in this tutorial I will be showing you how to create a PlayStation 2 uh, fake package for use with PS4. Things you're gonna need is a fake package generator for, uh, for PS2 remasters, uh, you're gonna need a PlayStation 2 uh, emulator sample file so that you can put an ISO there and of course you'll need an ISO game dump or download it doesn't really matter as long as it's a PlayStation 2 ISO file and you, you also need a GIMP to make proper packages uh, images package images and you also need a hex editor to make a custom JUSA code so you want so you can have multiple PlayStation 2 games installed so this tutorial will be split in split it in like two parts in one uh, the first one will be made I will be making a uh, just just a pa simple package that will show us if the game works boots and and like this and then we will be making images for the for the game so yes in this case uh, let's begin I will be using uh, need for speed most wanted my uh, own dump so uh, you want to open uh, orbispubgen.x you wanna go to uh, image 0 and basically put all our ps2 sample files in here and it should be good if you want to apply a custom Patches or conf yeah, actually no patches, not patches. Configs for your uh, game. You will have to open config mops for and apply it here. Oh, it opened on my uh, second monitor. It will be here. As you, uh, I only applied mm, my sample only adds a uh, 69 display mode. Nothing and uh, no no no, no more stuff. So pretty uh, basic config. And in the folder image, you have to add uh, your ISO. So just drag and drop it. And you also have to rename it to uh, disk01.iso. And also remember the letters must be small and not uh, big like here. So they really must be small. So we have it like this. Mm. We assign chunks. Uh, it's only four gigabyte game, so we every time for a PS2 remaster we only assign one chunk. So just chunk zero. It should be all good. Uh, we also need the um, content ID from the parmsfo that is included here. So I haven't copy pasted it for myself. So. I'll just hook up real quick uh, the proper uh, title ID because otherwise our sample package won't uh, won't build. Uh, uh, wait, wrong wrong program. <laughs> uh, wrong program, of course. You have to use uh, Orbis Poop SFO. To uh, check the SFO file, and of course, it's broken because it's a PS2 re uh, PS2 remaster SFO. So you really have to use the hex editor. I actually forgot it; haven't done it in a while. So you put it in the parameter in a parameter file in the hex editor and you copy this title ID otherwise the game won't boot we press copy we are done here so we just click click X we go to command project settings package we copy paste our uh, content ID we set as passcode just, z z just zero and we check storage type digital only and we press OK yes we press build actually let me build directly to my USB stick it will be uh, faster than it will be come on it will be faster than actual 
than actual ma making and copy pasting so just just to sa save ourselves a little bit time so we save it right here it will throw out a, a keystone error so we'll just uh, press again build and I will just I will rename it and press and retest click save build and we just wait till our image builds it's, it takes not not very long it's not a very long process it takes 10 minutes maybe five yeah something around around five minutes so after our package is built we can um, close this window don't close our fake package generator program yet we will use it later to inject our images so as you can see my uh, package has been saved here so um, let's switch real quick to the ps4 hook up, hook up our usb stick let me change uh, out the source real quick it's it will be easier for me to okay so uh, yeah we need to of course uh, we need to launch our uh, exploit and uh, ps4 hand uh, payloads so uh, it really depends on the method you do I am using the user user guide method uh, with uh, L as if tool and uh, and it kernel panicked I will be I will be back when it's when it, when I actually send send the payload. So yeah, after you launch the PS4 hand payload and if it don't if it doesn't kernel panic of course. We'll go to debug settings, game package installer and we install our um, test package. It's recommended to use uh, USB 3.0 usb drive because or an external hard drive because as you can see it's it's really quick i like that for the ps4 so now that it's installed you should get um um uh, entry like this word galaxy and without an icon so we'll we'll, la we'll launch it let's see if uh, the game will boot should boot and as you can see our game boots successfully so we have our uh, game working I won't go any further because I know the game works I already tried it before let's close the application now we want to switch now that we know that our um, game works we can hook up our USB stick back to our computer and uh, let's work on a final package because now we know that's working um, let's uh, switch to our PC and um, yeah let's make a as I always call it final package so in this case we will be modifying param sfo and adding images so mm, ah, I've closed the, I've, clo I've closed the for folder of course um, we go to our sample and we go to uh, dot sys or, yeah it's not a dot I don't remember how it's called we copy param sfo copy and um, I'll just make a, f a quick folder called uh, ima images because we also be working on that but first let's patch param sfo what we want to do to patch param sfo is open hey hey the the hex editor dra drag and drop param sfo and um, we want to do a couple of things here the first thing we want to do is the ch uh, change the title id and also the uh, tusa code so what I am always personally doing with my uh, with my dumps is uh, I take all I take the original title ID from the PS2 disc or an ISO. So in this case, it this will be our title ID for Need for Speed Most Wanted. 
so we just us we just tag these five let five numbers where is it here uh here five three five three five five eight ah i must i will just let do it like this because i i am not good at remembering stuff uh, five, three, five, five, eight. So this is our new uh, JSA code. We have to uh, co copy it, and we have to put it also here on the downs uh, uh, at the bottom. And here is our um, title, which we also want to change. We just type in need for speed most wanted and we also want to copy this because this will be necessary to make uh, make the package otherwise it will throw, throw, out, throw out error um, we copy this and uh, we just press save it also al always backs up so it's a uh, very handy and now what we want to do is um, go to package generator and uh, le let me put it already in the um, title ID so okay and now we have to uh, make images for our uh, game so I'll just we just go to Google or whatever and uh, it for speed most wanted I, I already tried it once before and um, it's very hard to find good quality images believe me it's not an easy task and I don't even know if I will find uh, proper images again because it's a really pain in ass to find good ones so uh, yeah I'll just type it uh, maybe cover Uh, yeah, we will just use this. I it doesn't doesn't need to look fancy or if you are doing it for yourself or something like this. So, yeah, I'll just go this for, for this as an example. Won't look very beautiful, but uh, yeah, you you can make your own. It's not that hard. And we also want uh, uh, bigger images for the background. And I will use this because it's already in a very good uh, uh, in our uh, resolution that we also need. So um, now that we have our two image files downloaded, um, I'm not a very good, I'm not skilled in graphic edit editions. So uh, I will just um, go to we open it with Paint and uh, we, ch we click uh, change. Um, size I'm sorry it's in Polish and our icon 0 must be 512 and fi uh, 512 x 512 press ok doesn't look very beautiful and save as a PNG file and um, we want to save this as um, You want to save this as icon zero, and we press save. And the second one is already. Oh, wait, wrong. The second one is already in uh, good resolutions. Uh, the second one is already in good resolution, so I won't be changing this. But what I do want to do, and of course I close the program. What I want to do, is, what we want to do, is also save it as a PNG file, and we want to call this pick one dot PNG. Press X, and now these images won't work yet with our package generators, so we need to flatten these because they are in PNG format. So to do this, we will need GIMP. It's the easiest possible method I found for it. It does take a while to actually start it up so after our 
GIMP is opened, we open the file uh, where our image is located and let's just first this and what we want to do to make our images actually work is go to image and flatten image this will actually make it compatible with uh, the fake packet generator because a PNG is always sometimes a PNG file has transparency and we don't want this because it won't work so now it's done we click export as and we just click export replace export and that's that's it and we want to do the same for the pick zero pick one PNG exactly the same image flatten image and export as uh, I opened the wrong one nice 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 I opened the wrong one we must use this image flatten image export as export replace export so now we have our images done and parametrical done what we go we, we go to our pack generator we uh, it already contains our ISO file if we haven't closed it so we go to uh, sys and yeah we put our icon 0 parametrical and pick 1 we put it here Uh, we 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 assign chunks because it um, changing files is deleting the chunk. It doesn't. If you replace a file, it isn't assigned to a chunk anymore. Uh, let's make sure our yes our title ID is changed, so it should build. We press build. NFSMV final, and we press build. And as you can see, it accepted our image files. And yes, so now it builds. And when it builds, you can install it. It will take a while. It takes around, I, I noticed that for 4 gigabyte and, and directly saving to your USB sticks, it uh, takes around 5 minutes. So we'll have to wait, wait a little bit. So after uh, after we finish uh, making our package and make uh, putting it on our USB stick, we uh, go back to our PS4, we go to uh, debug settings and we install the package, and we will see it. So when it's done installing, we will see Need for Speed Most Wanted and our uh, custom images will uh, be displayed and so that's the entire process of uh, making a fake PlayStation 2 package thank you for watching and I hope I helped you